Cambodia will be having the honor to take the chairmanship of the ASEAN. And it is with great pleasure that I have, on such a short notice, a very distinguished personality uh, who is nobody else but uh, Dr. Surin Pitsovan, who is the uh, Secretary General of the ASEAN. Welcome, Doctor. Thank you very yes. much, Sipani. Yeah. Yes. Uh, well, you know, uh, well, your visit to Cambodia with your, with your whole ASEAN team here, your meeting with the His Excellency, some like Prime Minister yesterday, with the Foreign Ministry, really set uh, a very strong uh, message uh, for the, the, the Cambodia foremost, yes. uh, yes. that uh, ASEAN uh, is very keen to support Cambodia's yes. chairmanship. Yes. But before we get to, to, to the substance, perhaps I'd like to give you a few minutes to maybe you tell a bit about your background to the audience. Well, I am a Thai. I was born in southern Thailand and uh, I went to school at a Buddhist temple. <laughs> Without shoes, <laughs> without shoes. <laughs> until I was 11, yes. uh, my first pair of shoes. But then, through determination, yes. uh, I got into Thammasat University. After two years, I got a scholarship to a small college in California. And after that, I got a scholarship to Harvard. I got a PhD from Harvard and coming back to teach at Thammasat University for a few years, roots. back to where I began and uh, there was a general election yes. in 1986 86. and they asked me if I would join. I didn't give them the answers, yes. but they made the announcement anyway. <laughs> so I didn't make a decision yes. to make a transition from academic life yes. to political life, yes. but events just pulled me into it yeah. and ever since Destiny. then I became deputy foreign minister foreign minister yes. and I have been asked yes. to come to take up this uh, general secretary secretary general's term which belongs to Thailand yes we rotate four years ago right four years ago yes, yes. Uh, the, the term is five years yes yes uh, before me it was Singapore yes, yes. now yes. Thailand yes next would be a gentleman or a lady from yes. Vietnam. Oh, I see. Yeah. So the one round is yes. 50 years. Oh, oh. oh one round yeah. is 50 yeah. years. Yeah. Yes. After Vietnam would be Brunei. Yes, yes. After Brunei, yeah. 10 so years. So your successor would be just Cambodia. got born. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> but tell me about <clears throat> ASEAN, the ASEAN Charter. Things are moving. We become, you know, the sort of like uh, the, the, the area where a different region look up to yeah. in the light of uh, the, 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 the so yes. like uh, ASEAN was born 44 yes. years ago yes. in Bangkok yes. on the 8th of August. It was, it was just a vision, a dream yes. uh, among five foreign ministers, yes. including Thanat Koman yes. in Thailand at that time. And they thought uh, small countries in Southeast Asia would need a stage, a forum yes. for ourselves, yes. rather than having to compete with the heavyweights yes. of the world, mm -hmm. like Afro-Asia yes, yes. conference, yes. like the UN, mm -hmm. and it was during the Cold War. Yes, yes. So five of them, five of us got together yeah. and uh, dream of a vision mm -hmm. yes. that we would become mm -hmm. one small association. Yes. And 40 some years later, you yeah. moved to institutionalized yes it become a charter yes the world that. has changed yes we have remained Why together the charter? and then uh, you know, competition hmm. uh, ASEAN was a loosely structured yes. organization regional organization quite effective yes but then because of the diversity yes among the membership yes we could not quite carry on or deliver yes. the commitments yes it based on trust based on words yes the global community would like to see ASEAN more of being a rule-based mm, organization, yes, yes, yes. Uh, contract with legal mm, mm. Uh, binding yes, yes. behind every agreement that we made. Yes. Just happened that the world was changing so fast, yeah. competition was so mm, fierce, globalization yeah. was going full force. Yeah. ASEAN, we have 600 million people. We have 10 Huge different market. economies. Mm. 10 different yes. governance yes. systems, yes. we decided to have uh, a charter yes. so that we can live together yes. based on that mm. charter. Yes. Now, the world is having more confidence in us. Yes. We behave more like a 
legal contractual parties. Yes. Whatever 